Prime Minister Narendra Modi visited France for a two-day official visit, where he co-chaired the AI Action Summit alongside French President Emmanuel Macron. The summit brought together world leaders, top tech executives, and policymakers to discuss AI's impact on global innovation, security, and governance. This was the third such summit. Previously, it was held in UK and South Korea in 2023 and 2024, respectively. In the UK summit in 2023, the Bletchley Declaration was signed, establishing a shared understanding of the opportunities and risks of frontier AI. In the 2024 summit in South Korea, the Seoul Declaration was signed, which confirmed a shared understanding of the opportunities and risks posed by AI. The AI Action Summit held this year in Paris was focused on five themes. After the summit this year, India, China, European Commission and over 50 countries signed the statement Inclusive and Sustainable Artificial Intelligence for People and the Planet. The signatories agreed to develop sustainable and inclusive AI and agreed on the need for narrowing the inequalities and assisting developing countries in artificial intelligence capacity building. The United States and United Kingdom have not signed the statement. UK government said it had not been able to add its name to it because of concerns about national security and global governance. US Vice President J.D. Vance has held that too much of regulation of artificial intelligence could kill a transformative industry just as it is taking off. Vance told world leaders that AI was an opportunity that the Trump administration will not squander and said pro-growth AI policies should be prioritized over safety. Further, India, Kenya, Germany, Chile, Finland, Slovenia, France, Nigeria and Morocco have launched a public interest AI platform and incubator. This is aimed at decreasing the division between existing public and private initiatives on public interest AI and addressing the digital divides. It will aim to create a trustworthy AI ecosystem advancing the public interest by supporting technical assistance and capacity building projects in data, model development, transparency, audit, compute, talent, financing and collaboration. Let us dive into what India is doing in this AI sector. India's National Strategy for Artificial Intelligence prepared by Niti Aayog has formulated the way forward to harness the power of artificial intelligence in various fields. Union Minister Shri Rajnath Singh is speaking at Invest Karnataka 2025 in Bangalore declared that Bangalore will give India its first foundational artificial intelligence model. Union IT Minister Shri Ashwini Vaishnav have also said that India is set to develop its own generative AI model and soon we will have our LLM. The G20 Presidency 2023, India has built a consensus on harnessing AI responsibly for good and for all. In its AI research reports, Essensure provided a framework for evaluating the economic impact of AI for select G20 countries. It estimates AI to boost India's annual growth rate by 1.3 percentage points by 2035. India was ranked 13th globally with 44 top-notch presenters at leading AI conferences globally. We launched the India AI mission in April 2024 under the Union Ministry of Electronics and Information Technology. This mission aims to create a comprehensive ecosystem that fosters AI innovation to make the benefits of AI reach all strata of society. This year's budget allocated rupees 2,000 crores to the India AI mission. 
This is a massive 1056% increase from last year's budget. Budget 2025-26 also provides an outlay of rupees 500 crores to establish a new center of excellence for artificial intelligence in education. The finance minister also announced a rupees 20,000 crore allocation for research, development, and innovation. Health and sustainable cities in 2023. Now a center of excellence in artificial intelligence for education will be set up with a total outlay of 500 crores. As part of this initiative, a deep tech fund of funds will be explored to catalyze the next generation of startups in emerging technologies such as AI, robotics, and quantum computing. As Prime Minister Sri Narendra Modi said in his remark, AI can help transform millions of lives by improving health, education, agriculture, and so much more. It can help create a world in which the journey to sustainable development goals becomes easier and faster. Further, the Prime Minister has said that India has one of the world's largest AI talent pools and we are building our own large language model considering our diversity. And India is ready to share its experience and expertise to ensure that the AI future is for good and for all. Artificial intelligence is disrupting our world. India is one of the fastest growing economies in the world. We have a significant stake in the AI revolution.